Hey guys, happy Friday. It's operations time again over here. I know a little late, but hey, don't worry. We're gonna make up for it here. We're gonna be running the SD40-2 uh, over here with uh, Mr. Torres and engineer Rick inside over there. We've got Benjamin on the hood. Let's get her fired up and uh, we'll get on our way over here. This should be a fun little operation. We're gonna be heading down to Cerritos and La Mirada. We're taking two cars with us, a hopper and a, a box car. It's our, kind of our final local here for that, you know, usually come in sort of uh, packs of three, you know what I mean? Uh, so when my hauler comes in, he usually gets divided up into like three locals. And this is the last one from prior uh, local, uh, which you can kind of see here sitting just off to the left-hand side is the new local. Anyway, let's get the lights on over here, get pointed in the right direction. Mm, sounding nice. All right, let's pull on out over here. And uh, so our cars we're taking, you see that uh, that kind of red uh, CN box car that, back there? And there's a hopper uh, behind it. We're gonna be taking those two guys and uh, we'll be heading down there. Now, uh, it should be relatively easy switching. I say that because well, we're only taking two box cars, but um, it should get a little bit interesting down there because we've got a lot of pickups down there and we got to respot um, a tank car because uh, one of these, I can't remember if it's the box car or the hopper, is actually going into the off spot. And uh, we currently have a tank car in the off spot over there. And so we're going to be putting that tank car into an industry. So that's kind of like three cars, really. Uh, we're just going to be doing a switcheroo down there. And then it looks like, I'm kind of looking over my uh, over my camera here, it looks like we got uh, four other pickups at a minimum there. So, uh, well, I think, well, I say at a minimum. No, I think we got like four other pickups over there, I think, maybe three. All right, right there will do. Let's give it a little stretch over here. Yeah, I think we got them all. I'm slide this back a little bit. Let's get on our way over here, man. We're daylights are burning, right? Woo! Holy smokes. Man, guys, I'm running late today. I didn't even get to do my uh, my flights in live stream. I had to post a video I had. I keep a, I keep a little stash of, uh, well, you know, a couple of videos because I fly my flights my flight sim uh, quite a bit, and so I just record it. And so I just had that one on... Uh, on tap just for a situation like this I actually had an appointment I had to go down to the uh, doctor's office nothing big just a re regular old checkup kind of stuff and uh, so I didn't get a chance to do my uh, my live stream today and then I got back and I was tired and I was running a little bit late it's already lunchtime over here and so now I'm finally getting around to doing the Friday video all right let's pop this thing up Let's get a nice little close view of this guy coming by, huh? Who doesn't like an SD40? Ooh, look at that. Benjamin, hold on over there. All right, so I'm going to put the camera down over here, as usual. We're going to kind of do this a little bit quick. Because uh, I don't want the video to be too long and it's already late. And uh, I just want to get this in the, in, the, in the can. You know how they say. All right, there we go. We'll switch that one. Let's keep on rolling there. We're going to make believe like Mr. Torres there is, uh, you know, running around doing all this for us. There we go. We're going to switch that one there. And let's come down here to, our, uh, to the woods. Watch this guy roll in. We think they got the, they cleared out all the weirdos over here in the little wooded area. I don't see any. All right, now um, if I recall correctly, hmm, actually I got I got to go look because <laughs> I don't recall correctly. I can't remember which uh, the box car. I think the box car is going to Royal Plywood over here. Uh, which we see right here. We're going to be picking up uh, these two cars, the uh, center beam. I know, don't ask. It, the, the, let's make believe that they get center beams here. And uh, that little flat car right there. Uh, a little bit more right there. All right. Now, the brake's on. Let's come over here. 
we're gonna switch this over here yeah because then the hopper is going to the uh, to the off spot over here I think that's the way it works you know what why don't I get my clipboard and take a look yep that's the way it was hopper is going to the off spot over there now normally I would say the hopper was gonna go over here but then I was thinking well we're picking these two guys up aren't we oh well, who knows apparently we're not we're not picking these two guys up they're staying right there hence why uh, this guy the hopper has got to go to the off spot so this should be well fairly easy let's uh let's start shoving back over here breaks off looking nice so the first thing we got to do is uh, actually get that uh, tank car way back there and uh, grab him and then stick him into a Titan transfer right there that's what we're doing and then dropping off the uh, dropping off the hopper right and then we do a quick run around and uh, we're gonna drop off the box car here and uh, pick up our two uh, lumber cars there pretty easy little operation here for a uh, Friday afternoon what time is it here it's uh, almost 3 o'clock p.m. holy smokes yeah, I'm really running late here today alrighty let's get in here hopefully we don't have any track issues I think I fixed all my track issues over here except possibly one drop I still need to do somewhere We'll see. All right, we'll get this guy over here. Ooh, 10 feet. That'll do right there. Ooh, beautiful, look at that. I love it. I love it when a, when a hopper works the way it's supposed to. The couplers work there. Um, actually, I just got lucky right there. <laughs> um, I do usually get a pencil, get a number two pencil, kind of shine up the, uh, you know, the couplers. So they get a nice little, uh, you know, connection. I do have some graphite. I usually uh, lube them up with a little bit of graphite also. I just haven't had a chance to, to be honest, so uh, I still got to do that. So I'm kind of happy that one worked out right there. Plus, uh, this uh, quality sort of uh, hopper that I have here has got nice coupler boxes, all that stuff. By the way, you know, I always uh, seems to have trouble with my couplers on my... Uh, my hoppers, my three cheap hoppers. Well, I, I know that everybody's giving me, uh, you know, sort of telling me what to do and all that. And, and I know I just got to go do it. But there's, you know, 50,000 other things I got to do. So uh, I do uh, have Katie couplers on there, though. Those are all Katie couplers on the other box cars there. Uh, let's see, we're going to switch just ooh, be nice if you could see this. Switch this and we're going into that track blue flag. Well, they're supposed to be, well, there's a blue flag, but, uh, where's Mr. Where is our, where is our industry rep? Oh my goodness sakes. And I'm swinging you all around. Look at this guy. He's still putzing around over here. Now, I know the, the blue flag has been removed, uh, over here, but the thing is that he's got to put it in once, uh, once we actually shove back there. Anyway, uh, as we do that. Looking nice. Anyway, as we uh, do this little shoving maneuver right here, um, yeah, I, so I, I do use uh, KD couplers. I, it's the first thing I do is uh, put KD couplers on all of my uh, rolling stock, and uh, I paint the tires. I paint the wheels. <laughs> Tire. I love saying tires because it triggers people. You know what I mean? Because um, uh, it's one thing that triggers me is shiny tires. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get back here without knocking anything over. Uh, it looks like we're pretty good. Are we going to go all the way? Yeah, we'll shove it. Uh, we'll shove it right. A little bit more, a little bit more. Right there will do. Ooh, perfect. All right, we'll cut this guy loose right here. Um, anyway, yeah, the the other hoppers that I have, they've got like the cheapo box, uh, little uh, coupler boxes. I got I got to kind of. Ooh, excuse me, man. Ooh. A little uh, afternoon after lunch indigestion here. Um, yeah, I gotta kind of you know work those uh, coupler boxes there, put new boxes on, all that good stuff. You know, or uh, kind of MacGyver it. That's usually what I end up doing in some fashion. 
All right, we'll do this drop off, pull forward, do a little uh, run around, get the real plywood done. Look at that. Well, I think I'm out of the industry officially. I can say that has been the smoothest little operation here at Titan Transfer. There we go. Blue flag back on the track right there. Let's go ahead and shove this guy back. Anyway, you guys know how it goes. Always something to do. And uh, stuff guys just kind of takes priority. And unfortunately, the coupler boxes have not taken a priority. Somebody mentioned, because uh, I was talking about possibly having, you know, opening up the, the layout for uh, sort of operations and stuff like that in the future. And uh, somebody said, you got to fix that stuff before. <laughs> before I'll be sure to uh, have that on the... the before we do operations with anybody else, couplers. I'm gonna fix all the couplers, lube them all up uh, and all that stuff and uh, fix those couplers on the, uh, the hoppers. All right, enough with the hoppers. How's everybody doing? Have a good week? All right, we're gonna shove this guy right down here and that uh, right there is good, I think. There we go. We'll uh, disconnect right here. And then go forward and I get the rest of this little operation done. Ooh, somebody forgot to put the brake on right there, I think. All right. Forward we go. Yeah, so hope everybody had a good week so far and they're gonna have a good weekend here. I guess it was a short weekend for some of you guys that are still, uh, you know, slugging it out, working nine to five. Like, you know, you probably are, you know, actually working like seven to six. That's the new nine to five, I guess. Woo, glad I'm not doing that anymore. All right, now then, uh, before we pull in here, now we're gonna, yeah, I was thinking of just going into the industry and grabbing our cars first, but uh, now we gotta, we gotta kind of drop off right there. Ooh, slow it down, slow it down. So let me give you a little bigger picture right here. So we're gonna be picking up these uh, two cars right there, but uh, I was thinking, oh, maybe I should just run in there, and grab these two and then do the run around, but the, yeah, we don't got enough room right there. Uh, by the way, that's the other reason that uh, that I took the SD40 down here. Cause, uh, you know, a little, uh, sometimes a little space constrained. Uh oh, look at that. Mm. Sheesh, sheesh, Mr. Torres, you set the brake on that sucker. All right. Um, but yeah, I usually take into consideration. I kind of know now, you know, where, um, you know, where the tight spots are on my layout here. And, uh, and this is kind of one of them. If I took the regular uh, local there with the two, uh, you know, Jeeps, it, it would still work right here with kind of what we're doing uh, in this case. But uh, I kind of figured I wasn't sure what we were doing with these two boxcars, whether they were coming or going. And so uh, that's why I figured... What the heck, let's take the SD40 over here. Plus, uh, that way, got a nice big floor out front there for uh, Mr. Torres. And Benjamin, ooh, we haven't had the bell yet. Let's set the bell over here while uh, we get the turnout uh, flopped over. And the guy in the dump truck's getting pissed. All right, back we go, around we go, and we'll uh, get the camera down here a little bit. There we go, we'll get that like that. We'll get that like that, break off. This will be a nice little uh, nice little video over here, huh? That's nice. That's what, This is what I needed for a uh, Friday afternoon after I've been kind of in a rush today. It's a nice, easy one. And that was another reason. I just wanted one locomotive. Just make it easy here. Don't be starting to stack the deck there against me. Since I didn't know what the heck was going to be uh, happening here. All right, we'll get that done right there. We'll get our runaround completed here. We'll shove back into the industry. And then go chill out for the rest of the Friday, uh, Friday afternoon here. Ooh, right there is good. And 
Now it's starting to get toasty over here in Southern California. Unfortunately, I think next week it's going to be in the 90s. Ugh. Which, uh, I know there's probably some parts of the country where it's already been in the 90s, but that, uh, hey, that's, that's okay. Over here, we have had our lovely marine layer keeping things nice and cool. And, uh, so it hasn't been too hot. Um, I think like the mid 80s, so high 80s, I should say, is the worst that we've had it so far. And, uh, and then usually that's just, you know, for like an hour or something. The rest of the time it's nice, you know. Starts out at like, you know, 56 or something in the morning and then, uh, you know, cools down as soon as the sun sets, man, that drops like 20 degrees or something. Open the windows, get a nice breeze. All right, we head into the industry here and guess what? We need uh, another blue flag over here. Yep, let me, uh, let me put my uh, skewer down over here. By the way, what was it? Heath was saying from uh, Humanity Junction there, he was saying, uh, you know, you should use, uh, I think he was being sarcastic. Uh, it, uh, what do you call it? Knitting needles. I hope he was being sarcastic, because, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that would work. What do you guys, what do you guys think? Heath, if you see this, were you, like, being serious? Ooh, right there's good, because the whole thing with these is, uh, you know, let me get, so you can see it here, so you can whittle these down. This is just a chopstick. And uh, so I just whittle it down and make sure it's got a nice sharp point to it. And it gives you those little flat edges, you know? So it's like a whittled, it's not perfect. And so, I don't know, maybe that's causing my problems, I don't know. And that way, when I go in there, I just do a little twisty and, uh, you know, it kind of grabs it more. So I would think that if you had a perfectly sharp thing, it probably wouldn't. At least I think that's the way it would work. Now, all right, anyway. Back to our little operations here. Okay, so since we're going to be going up the uh, wooded area right here, come on, we're going to turn that over so we can go in and out through there. I think I had the brakes off. All right, let's go. We got the blue flag out of the way. Benjamin's on the hood. Mr. Torres is, uh, uh, I don't know what he's doing over there, dancing around on the dance floor. And we're gonna pull these guys out. We'll drop off our CN car and then head back home. Anyway, I say I talk about the weather over here because, well, it's uh, like I said, it's like three in the afternoon here, and I can feel it. Because it's a little bit of it's a little bit of warmth over here. It's getting a little toasty here in the uh, in the garage. Hey, at least the lighting's good because it uh, you know comes through the windows and all that. So I get uh, I get some nice it gets nice and bright over here. Kind of easier to film. I should do all my filming over here at 3 a.m. or 3 a.m. I mean 3 p.m. <laughs> Goodness. All right, uh, half a car and right there is good. Okay. Disconnect. You see how that it works? It, it works good right there. I like that. Watch now, me. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go get a. I don't know. Some smooth, sharp thing and try to disconnect it. <laughs> Watch it work better. I don't know. Go figure. Uh, right there is good, Engineer Rick. Anyway. Bring her back in here. Oh man, this is gonna be nice. This is like my first industry. You old timers know, this was like the first thing I uh, sort of, well I say scratch built, but this was the first industry that I kind of uh, scenicked over here with uh, this uh, quote temporary uh, building that has been here for years and years, waiting to be upgraded. All right there, that looks good. Let me get you a little down low shot over here. We'll grab our pickups and be on our way. I love it. 
That was a uh, that was a nice simple little operations here. Ooh, right there is good. I think I, I think I put the brakes back on. All right, here we go. Come on, keep it coming there, Engineer Rick. And, ooh, right there is good. Ooh, look at that, perfect timing, my camera's overheating. That means uh, we did a, a full length video here. Either that or it's uh, a little bit warm in the garage here and it's overheating sooner. All right, we're heading on out. Let's head back to the, uh, back to the yard. See you later, Carl. Have a good one, don't drink too much. Just in case some vagrants show up over there in the wooded area. All right, we're gonna keep on running out over here. Let's get a final look here. Looking nice. All right, I'm gonna back her out. Boop, 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 beep, beep, beep. Okay. We'll put our bridge down. I'm gonna notch it up. And uh, let's see. Now, uh, Mr. Sanford and the new guy over here, they were supposed to be uh, classifying these cars and kind of cleaning up the yard, so I don't know, they haven't started yet. Uh, I think we're going to run in there. We'll take the, uh, what is that, number three track. Ooh, hurry up before the, uh, before the camera dies. Anyway guys, hope you had uh, a good time here. A little bit a little bit of fun switching over there. It's always fun trying a couple different things. Listen, you know, like I said before, uh, having all these little car spots and industries and uh, even different locomotives and such, it makes for some fun over here because uh, you never know what the, what the heck's gonna happen. You might end up uh, kind of lucky like we did here and it was uh, pretty straightforward or you might, uh, you might think you're gonna have a straightforward little operation and you end up having a really complicated one which can be fun all in itself. All right, as we run into the yard here, I'm gonna say have a good weekend and I will see you guys on Monday, uh, either in the live stream there at uh, 9 a.m. Pacific time, or uh, what is that, noon Eastern time over there, or uh, I'll see you in the video that uh, same day. Ooh, take care, have a good one guys, bye.